Should the Maori tamoko be banned in public? The burka is banned in many countries worldwide for varying reasons. In New Zealand, some residents, typically of Maori descent, have a full face tattoo which is called a tamoko. This can be quite intimidating to many people, especially those who are unfamiliar with Maori culture. In fact, many people who are familiar with the Maori culture also find the tamoko unattractive and intimidating whether full face or half face. The kaupapa hasn't hurt anybody. Mm. Whanau water hasn't hurt anybody. Now it's become elitist and extreme. Ordinary Māori don't get any say whatsoever. It's an ordinary Māori. Well, I'll finish off and tell you that because I was brought up with them. I've just been kicked out because I don't meet the dress code. Unsure what it is about the dress code that I don't meet. Then I went up to the bar and I, I says, excuse me, sir, I need a cash out. And he turned around and says, yeah, you do. You need to get out. And I said, excuse me, sorry. And he says... You don't meet the dress code, I'm kicking you out. Now get out. It confirmed for me that it was because of my my moko that he kicked me out. You know, this isn't a facial tattoo like a facial tattoo. It's not, you know, words and crosses and all that sort of stuff. You know, this is part of our identity. It's the Maori people's elites, iwi leaders, etc., etc. So who just are to be folks. clear, you have no evidence that this is happening, oh, that this, and you can't name a single, and you can't this. name a single I'm Maori elite. Going, it's not that I can't. I'm not going to. It's a trouble that doesn't filter down. You all the think that? Do you th- the whole lot? Sorry, the what? Quite frankly, at first glance, it looks like a fighting style war paint tattoo, without much art or creativity behind the design. Take a large spider's cobweb, spray it with octopus black ink, and then walk into the wet inky cobweb face first. That is what a tamoko looks like to many people. Unless you're into this type of artwork, it's actually ugly, and definitely intimidating. Question, should the Maori tamoko be banned in public? Thank you for listening. Geraint, on behalf of Funerate Hemp.